Psalm 133, A Song of Degrees of David Behold how good and how pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity. It is like the precious ointment upon the head that ran down upon the beard, even Aaron's beard, that went down to the skirts of his garments, as the dew of Hermon, and as the dew that descendeth upon the mountains of Zion, for there the Lord commanded the blessing, even life for evermore. Psalm 134, A Song of Degrees Behold, bless ye the Lord, all ye servants of the Lord, which by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands in the sanctuary, and bless the Lord. The Lord that made heaven and earth bless thee out of Zion. Psalm 135 Praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the name of the Lord, praise him, O ye servants of the Lord. Ye that stand in the house of the Lord, in the courts of the house of our God, praise the Lord. For the Lord is good. Sing praises unto his name, for it is pleasant. For the Lord hath chosen Jacob unto himself and Israel for his peculiar treasure. For I know that the Lord is great, and that our Lord is above all gods. Whatsoever the Lord pleased, that did he in heaven, and in earth, in the seas, and all deep places. He causeth the vapors to ascend from the ends of the earth. He maketh lightnings for the rain. He bringeth the wind out of his treasuries. Who smote the firstborn of Egypt, both of man and beast. Who sent tokens and wonders into the midst of thee, O Egypt, upon Pharaoh, and upon all his servants who smote great nations, and slew mighty kings, Sion king of the Amorites, and Og king of Bashan, and all the kingdoms of Canaan, and gave their land for an heritage, an heritage unto Israel his people. Thy name, O Lord, endureth for ever, and thy memorial, O Lord, throughout all generations. For the Lord will judge his people, and he will repent himself concerning his servants. The idols of the heathen are silver and gold, the work of men's hands. They have mouths, but they speak not, eyes have they, but they see not, they have ears, but they hear not, neither is there any breath in their mouths. They that make them are like unto them, so is every one that trusteth in them. Bless the Lord, O house of Israel, bless the Lord, O house of Aaron. Bless the Lord, O house of Levi, ye that fear the Lord, bless the Lord. Blessed be the Lord out of Zion, which dwelleth at Jerusalem. Praise ye the Lord. Psalm 136 O give thanks unto the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endureth for ever. O give thanks unto the God of gods, for his mercy endureth for ever. O give thanks to the Lord of lords, for his mercy endureth for ever. To him who alone doeth great wonders, for his mercy endureth for ever. To him that by wisdom made the heavens, for his mercy endureth for ever. To him that stretched out the earth above the waters, for his mercy endureth for ever. To him that made great lights, for his mercy endureth for ever. The sun to rule by day, for his mercy endureth for ever. The moon and stars to rule by night, for his mercy endureth for ever. To him that smote Egypt in their firstborn, for his mercy endureth for ever. And brought out Israel from among them, for his mercy endureth for ever with a strong hand, and with a stretched out arm, for his mercy endureth for ever. To him which divideth the Red Sea into parts, for his mercy endureth for ever. And made Israel to pass through the midst of it, for his mercy endureth for ever. But overthrew Pharaoh and his host in the Red Sea, for his mercy endureth for ever. To him which led his people through the wilderness, for his mercy endureth for ever.
to him which smote great kings, for his mercy endureth for ever, and slew famous kings, for his mercy endureth for ever. Sion king of the Amorites, for his mercy endureth for ever, and Og the king of Bashan, for his mercy endureth for ever, and gave their land for an heritage, for his mercy endureth for ever, even an heritage unto Israel his servant, for his mercy endureth for ever, who remembered us in our low estate, for his mercy endureth for ever and hath redeemed us from our enemies, for his mercy endureth for ever, who giveth food to all flesh, for his mercy endureth for ever. O give thanks unto the God of heaven, for his mercy endureth for ever. Psalm 137 by the rivers of Babylon, there we sat down, yea, we wept, when we remembered Zion. We hanged our harps upon the willows in the midst thereof, for there they that carried us away captive required of us a song, and they that wasted us required of us mirth, saying, Sing us one of the songs of Zion. How shall we sing the Lord's song in a strange land? If I forget thee, O Jerusalem, let my right hand forget her cunning. If I do not remember thee, let my tongue cleave to the roof of my mouth. If I prefer not Jerusalem above my chief joy. Remember, O Lord, the children of Edom in the day of Jerusalem, who said, Raise it, raise it even to the foundation thereof. O daughter of Babylon, who art to be destroyed, happy shall he be that rewardeth thee as thou hast served us. Happy shall he be that taketh and dasheth thy little ones against the stones. Psalm 138, A Psalm of David I will praise thee with my whole heart. Before the gods will I sing praise unto thee. I will worship toward thy holy temple, and praise thy name for thy loving kindness and for thy truth. For thou hast magnified thy word above all thy name. In the day when I cried, thou answeredst me, and strengthenest me with strength in my soul. All the kings of the earth shall praise thee, O Lord, when they hear the words of thy mouth. Yea, they shall sing in the ways of the Lord, for great is the glory of the Lord. Though the Lord be high, yet hath he respect unto the lowly, but the proud he knoweth afar off. Though I walk in the midst of trouble, thou wilt revive me. Thou shalt stretch forth thine hand against the wrath of mine enemies, and thy right hand shall save me. The Lord will perfect that which concerneth me. Thy mercy, O Lord, endureth for ever. Forsake not the works of thine own hands. Psalm 139 To the Chief Musician, A Psalm of David O Lord, Thou hast searched me and known me. Thou knowest my down-sitting, and mine uprising, Thou understandest my thought afar off. Thou compassest my path, and my lying down, And art acquainted with all my ways. For there is not a word in my tongue, But lo, O Lord, Thou knowest it altogether. Thou hast beset me behind and before, And laid Thine hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me, it is high, I cannot attain unto it. Whither shall I go from thy spirit, or whither shall I flee from thy presence? If I ascend up into heaven, thou art there. If I make my bed in hell, behold, thou art there. If I take the wings of the morning, and dwell in the uttermost parts of the sea, even there shall thy hand lead me, and thy right hand shall hold me. 
If I say, Surely the darkness shall cover me, even the night shall be light about me. Yea, the darkness hideth not from thee, but the night shineth as the day, the darkness and the light are both alike to thee. For thou hast possessed my reins, thou hast covered me in my mother's womb. I will praise thee, for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvelous are thy works, and that my soul knoweth right well. My substance was not hid from thee when I was made in secret and curiously wrought in the lowest parts of the earth. Thine eyes did see my substance, yet being unperfect, and in thy book all my members were written, which in continuance were fashioned, when as yet there was none of them. How precious also are thy thoughts unto me, O God! How great is the sum of them! If I should count them, they are more in number than the sand. When I awake, I am still with thee. Surely thou wilt slay the wicked, O God! Depart from me, therefore, ye bloody men! For they speak against thee wickedly, and thine enemies take thy name in vain. Do I not hate them, O Lord, that hate thee? And am not I grieved with those that rise up against thee? I hate them with perfect hatred, I count them mine enemies. Search me, O God, and know my heart. Try me, and know my thoughts, and see if there be any wicked way in me and lead me in the way everlasting.